we are on our way for a field trip one day in Detroit. We are going to hang out with the people from Ford. Yeah, and we're going to ride in some race cars. Race cars. And we're going to go. We're gonna go <laughs> I don't know if we're going to ride in any cars. race cars. We're going self-driving cars. Self-driving cars? That? They have self-driving cars. I don't know if we're doing that today. This is a very snug flight. But uh, I'm okay with that because I'm with the, the beautiful Mama Bee. Good morning. Good morning. Ford invited us to go to visit a factory and to visit a lab. Mama Lee, when you think about Ford, what do you what do you think about? Big trucks. Big trucks, motors, cars. But they also do other stuff. They have sustainability initiatives. Apparently they use like coconut, soy yeah. uh, ingredients that would go into compost. Yeah. They use things that would go into the compost anyways right. into their cars. Yeah. So it's great because they're not harming the environment and they're thinking about future generations. Yeah. Future generations, so that's why we want to take the monkeys with us to show them that these huge, huge car companies are doing something to help the environment. We were in the, at the White House. That's right. Remember, we were there for climate change. Yeah. And now we are working with Ford mm -hmm. for sustainability, so there's a theme here. There's a nice theme. Yeah. It's an earthy theme. Protecting our environment, yeah. protecting our earth, our beautiful, beautiful, beautiful earth. earth. Beautiful earth. I need more coffee. <laughs> And I think the second video is going to be a fact. Good morning, folks. Welcome aboard. My name is Andrika. I am your in-charge flight attendant on your flight today to Detroit. All right, folks. Welcome to Detroit. Local time is 9.55 a.m. For your safety, please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened. So right now we made it to Detroit and I'm really excited because we're gonna see some really cool stuff like cars, cars made of coconuts or something. Are you excited my friend? I'm very excited my friend. So we're gonna go to a lab now and her name is Debbie, she runs the lab, she's a scientist, and she makes really cool stuff, and she makes foam. Like oh, the foam wow. seats, so she experiments with so the squishiness of the foam seats. Oh, I wanna see how squishy it is. So you get to ask a lot of questions about what kind of materials they use. Hello, what's your name, what kind of materials you use, what is this foam, do you use it in the seats, what's your middle name, what's your last name, what's your age? Those are the questions you're gonna ask? Yes. <laughs> they use like tomato skins from the ketchup and they put it in the car parts, they put money, like old currency. Like copper? No, like bills, like dollar bills. Dollar they actually dollar shred dollar dollar, dollar bills. Oh my god, it's way so fast. Oh. <laughs> Here, take your jacket, I'm not your butler. All right. Oh, hi. Thank you. Hi. Monkeys, look at all the foam. How's that foam? Is it oh, slow it's rising? So low, so low. There it is. They're 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 fascinated by the squishiness of foam. Yeah. Where do you think foam comes from now? Um, Where do these materials come from? Hmm. They come from petroleum. You drill into the ground and you get oil, and then you refine it into all different products. Plastics are one of those products. Alpern, I think, one day we are going to run out of oil, and so what we wanted to do was use soybeans instead of oil. Now that sounds wacky, right? Yeah. Soybeans, when you squish them, you get soybean oil. So it's really not that different. And we said, let's make soy foam instead of petroleum foam. Eventually, after five or six years, we were able to put soybeans in and make a foam that's just like the petroleum-based foam. I find that petroleum is a little softer. Yeah, a little softer. You're absolutely right. You could be a scientist, right? <laughs> so you guys want to go make a foam? Yeah. All right. You can see all the different things that I've added. So why don't you guys each take one of the pipettes, fill it up to about halfway. Okay. I'm gonna put it down here and you guys can watch it. It'll blow up a little bit. Whoa. Whoa. Oh yeah. What is One is a cross-linking reaction, yep. making it strong, and one of them is a blowing reaction, making the bubbles. Okay. That's how it rises. Everybody run! Yeah. It's like a yeah. giant muffin. What do you guys think? Yeah. It looks so cool. 
So you see how it didn't spill over? That's because of that other reaction that's creating the cross linking so it kept together instead of falling over the side. Yeah, so cool. Yeah. yeah it doesn't pour over, oh, it just wow. starts going up. Yeah, it's just... It looks like a muffin. So after, you know, five minutes or so, that becomes soft to the touch, kind of like the phones out there. They're emitting huge amounts of CO2. What if we took that waste stream and made material out of it? That's unbelievable. Yay! Yeah. I know, it's so exciting. For the mm -hmm. environment, like that's the, the, the worst gas. We're way ahead of the mm -hmm. game. We can already imagine making materials out of carbon dioxide. Wow. Is it squishy? It's not only snow rising, which I'm very disappointed. Uh, um, but it's really squishy and I really like that. So here's the portion you eat, the top. All of the straw is left over. Now, in 2010, this bin is 20% wheat straw. And it's in the wow. Ford Flex. Wow. So here's the hair off the coconut. You guys can... And here it is inside the plastic. Yeah, you can totally wow. see it. But it looks kind of cool too, yeah. right? You guys, guys know what that is? Money. Yes. Money. Money, money, money. You can touch it. Money. And then when the money gets old, you've seen those old dollar bills, right? They don't go into the thing anymore when you're trying to buy something and they keep shooting them out. The U.S. government grinds them up and they burn it. They produce carbon dioxide. Mm -hmm. That's not good. I can tell that there was shredded money in here. There's like $3 this is what it looks like when you mold it, right? That's $25 right there. Whoa. And then you could put like $100. <laughs> <laughs> A coin bin out of money. Ooh. Whoa. Two billion pounds of tomatoes they wow. squeeze every single year. So this is the leftover skins and seeds. So think of this giant, giant pile of this stuff and we don't wow. have anything really to do with it. It may not be as pretty oh. yet. It's, it's like pretty, beef jerky. But it, I guarantee it's the world's first tomato-based plastic. So that's liquid nitrogen. Liquid nitrogen. Super cold, what is it, minus 200? Yep. Wow. Whoa! Whoa. Just bouncing am I right? So let's see what happened here. Oh it's hard. Oh wow. There it is, you got oh, it. Oh you're good at that. Yeah, yeah fishing. Whoa. Look at that. They're like gumballs now. It looks like a noodle. Whoa! <laughs> it's like a stick. Oh, oh you see that? that? You see that? Look at that smoke. You see that? <laughs> there you go. All right, ready? Wow. <laughs> Whoa, it is <laughs> all breaking. Great. What else can we put in there? What else? What else? What else? <laughs> Let's do something. Let's put in a person. Let's put in a person and stomp on it. Let's not put in a person. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So let's keep. He's got destruction on his mind. Oh, I know what he's thinking. Whoa. Oh, I know what he's thinking. Look at these. All right, ready? Yeah. Oh. That's awesome. Too bad I didn't get the slow motion. That you got that. That's awesome. Yeah. All right, let's. We never did money. it before. You would be like the best babysitter. Yeah, yeah that would be so much fun. Yeah. Yeah. I would pay big money to have you as my kid's babysitter. Yeah, that would be sick. Like, <laughs> best babysitter baby. ever. Best babysitter ever. Everything's yeah. frozen yeah. and broken. Television. Now let's do my mom's jewelry. <laughs> Is the money in there? Oh. oh. Can you even get a blob of that money? There oh, you go. Oh, throw, oh, it oh, throw it down. There it is. Throw it down. Whoa. Wow. Wow. This is like the coolest day ever. Wow. I'm so glad we here. This is fun. Okay. See, she's Squeeze it. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, go. Whoa. Wow. This, much to your happiness, is completely full of liquid nitrogen. <gasps> and it cool. <laughs> you guys can think about what you'd smash if you had your own tank of liquid nitrogen. Yeah, that was fun. I'd probably hide in there, and if someone found me, I'd be like... <laughs> <laughs> and oh, wow, pencils. look at that, guys. Wow, wow. Oh, It's like trick-or-treat. You. This is like trick-or-treat. Oh. We're all scientists now. We're unofficial scientists. 
<laughs> that we passed the test. Look, and you got the, the, the measurements, and you got the, the rulers, and the pens, and the... <laughs> wow, look, it's... What's, 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 the, what's the hypothesis today? Yeah. What's your hypothesis? Today we will be uh, saving the world <laughs> one uh, carbon uh, nu neutron. <laughs> one carbon neutron at a, at a time? What did you learn today, scientist, Miss Monkey? We learned that you can smash spoons with liquid nitrogen. Oh, right. Yeah. What did you find in the plastic today? So you can make stuff using shredded money mm -hmm. or with uh, the scraping or with the, um, skins? the skins of a tomato mm -hmm. from Heinz. <laughs> oh my god, that felt so cool! I couldn't help You just got oh, like liquid nitrogen that. dumped all over her yeah. feet and that felt so cool. My shoes are so crunchy now. Thank you so much. You're I really welcome. appreciate it. Thank thanks, you. Thanks for coming. Debbie, thank you so thank much. You. Wow, that was so cool. You guys are hired as our babysitters. <laughs> Anytime. We'll cover the flights. That was the best experience ever. Okay, so this is the first of two videos. And that was amazing. Education. Education. Sustainability. Saving the earth. Huge. Thank you, Ford, for inviting us yeah. here, for taking us behind the scenes, yeah. for, for giving the monkeys the experience of their that lives. Was the that was the oh best experience. Was so I'm fun. never going to forget that. That yeah. was awesome. And it continues. Yeah. Because we're going to the Rouge factory now. Ooh. And we're going to see some really, really cool stuff. You guys ready? Yes. All right, let's go. Yeah, y'all. Thanks for watching everybody, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, please click on the icon on the left and a little thing will pop up and you get to subscribe. If you already have subscribed, please forget everything that I have just said. It's that voice. It's my radio voice. Bye.